Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching this video. Today, oh my goodness, I am so excited because I have a box from none other, the legendary Super Plastic, and I can't wait to tell you all about this, so let's get into it. Hey guys, this is so exciting. I could not wait to make this video. I have been looking so forward to it because I actually won a super plastic contest on Discord, which was so much fun. I was beside myself when I found out that I had won. And what had happened was in one of the Discord chats, there was a contest to guess what someone would be unboxing. And if you guess what was in the box, then you won. I ended up going with a classic piece that I absolutely love. And that is the LA Blue by OG Slick and Super Plastic. I'll insert a photo right here. It is so gorgeous. And they have done a few collaborations with OG Slick and Super Plastic and they have just been out of this world. I actually bought one of my family members, the Black Widow piece that was a New York City exclusive. It is so incredible. Super Plastic is literally out of this world. They were my first company that I ever collected designer toys from. I have visited their New York City showroom time and time again, and I have picked up so many pieces, guys. It's insane. I love Super Plastic, and when I fell in love with Super Plastic, I fell in love hard. I truly fell in love with the different approach that they had to working with different artists and adapting that beautiful janky and googiemon form to fit the artist's vision. Some of my most favorite artists have done incredible collaborations with them. So stay tuned, guys. I cannot talk about Super Plastic and my love for them enough. I will be creating a full collection video, which Get ready, it's going to be insane. So let's go ahead and open up this box, guys. Again, I love the tape on here being those iconic super plastic lightning bolts. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait. Let's go ahead and crack it open. I also just wanted to say thank you so much to Super Plastic. You guys are awesome. You always do a lot with Discord and I love this community. Again, it was my first collectible ever and foray into designer toys and how special that this opportunity came up and I cannot believe I won Super Plastic and OG Slick and all the amazing Super Plastic artists. I love you guys. Your vision and just passion for designer toys and art is just out of this world. And it's something that is really connected with me. And as you can see, if you can't already tell, something that is definitely very prevalent in my collecting journey and in my life. So I opened up the box. Let's go ahead. I think we're going to do this like blind box style because I think it'd be so much fun if I don't look and we see what's in the box together. So I'm not going to look, but let's go ahead. I think this is some wrapping paper. <gasps> Beautiful super plastic wrapping paper. I'm definitely holding on to this. And let's go ahead and take a look at what's in the box. Oh my gosh, guys. I think there's a couple things that we have to open in here. <gasps> oh my gosh guys it's one of the pins from the janky heist holy cow i love pin collecting and this is so pretty and i love the card that it's on oh my goodness and look at janky he looks so cute this is freaking awesome i cannot wait to put this next to my whole super plastic collection okay so our next item out is <gasps> Oh my goodness, we're gonna have to open this right now. Let me close up this box so I don't see. It is one of the Super Plastic and Gorillas collectibles. Oh my goodness, guys. Another thing, Super Plastic really introduced me to Gorillas. I love them as a band, as artists. Their music is beautiful. So check them out and their collaborations. Holy cow, this is the mini series by Super Plastic. And of course, we have a ton of the Gorillas characters. From the band, um, they're pretty awesome. You should definitely give them a listen. Their music is really, really cool. And Super Plastic has actually done a bunch of collabs with them. They have the space astronauts. They had some of the more generic figures. They actually had a truck with Noodle that is really, really difficult to find. So these are all the different collectibles that we could potentially pull from here. So let's go ahead and crack it open. If you guys know me, we always go from the bottom of the box so we protect the top. So I'm just going to open this up. This is so amazing. 
And we have our traditional super plastic foil packet, of course. And let's go ahead and see what we got. It is, oh my gosh, guys, it's Russell. Russell is awesome. He's the drummer for Gorillaz. If you don't know kind of the lore behind Gorillaz, you should definitely look it up. It is a real band, but they have these animated characters that are very prevalent in their stage performance and in their music videos. Their music videos are amazing. So the next one is, how awesome, it's another Gorillaz box. Okay, I'm really excited. Ooh, this one came with a janky sticker. Wait, let me check the other box now, just to make sure. Of course, oh my goodness, guys. Hold on a second. One of my first super plastic pieces that I ever got in my collection was the beautiful, beautiful Death Strokes Chop Chop in gray and white. You know what? Hold on. I'm just going to show you guys. I love the Chop Chop collection. I have several of them. They are just amazing collectibles. And just the sculpture of these beautiful designer toys, you can also move Googie's head a little bit, is just so unique. And that's what really drew me to Super Plastic, is how different they were from every other designer toy out there, how innovative their designs were, how beautiful these sculptures were, down to the little Nick in the axe here. I mean, everything just has so much detail put into it and so much love. And of course, we love Googiemon. It brought me to think a little bit about one of my earliest collectibles, which was my Deathstrokes Chop Chop. And I just wanted to show them off and show off this beautiful sticker. I love their sticker so much, by the way. I keep every single one. Okay, so let's go ahead and actually open up the blind bag now. Ooh, I don't know which this one is gonna be. I kind of feel like it's going to be Noodle, and I kind of hope it is, because I love her in the band. <gasps> oh my goodness, hold on. It is Noodle, but let's see which variant it is. Okay, we definitely just pulled a really exclusive one. Holy cow, I was just saying I hope it's Noodle, and not only did we get Noodle, but I think we got a really rare one. So it says on here, there is a Noodle that looks just like this. One out of 18 chance. But that is in like a white, blue red and green colorway so if you can see right here that's the noodle there but mine's in gray and white so i think we just pulled a really exclusive one holy cow and also russell from before was a one out of 24 chance so he is also really rare too oh my goodness guys this is awesome super plastic you guys are the best so let's go ahead our next one it's a cranky blind box guys this is amazing just closing up the box there so we keep it a secret let's go ahead i have a few crankies and i love them so much from some of my favorite artists and i love that they have the little attachments so i'm really excited to see what we pull is the janky brightmare collaboration with alex party and super plastic i actually might have him i can't confirm or deny but you'll have to check out my collection video coming soon one of my favorite pieces super plastic has ever done so it's funny again that i pulled that sticker of something that i may or may not have we'll have to see so let's open him up and see what's inside You're joking me right now, right? Guys, I am so unlucky when it comes to blind boxes. But holy cow. So I want to get the number right here. But he is super rare. This is called Mist and it is one out of 96. Oh my goodness. My most rare cranky up until this point was a one out of 24. Take a look how beautiful he is, by the way. I love him. Oh my goodness, he's going right into my display. You can always check those feet and see the Super Plastic logo as well as the artist. And last but not least, we have to open up his tiny weapons to add to him. So let's go ahead and crack these open. And we'll go ahead and add them to his hands. Next. <gasps> Guys, it is a janky series four blind box i'm so so excited let's crack this open and see what we got i do have one of the janky series four pieces again more to come in my upcoming collection video 
but it is by an artist that actually did an eight inch version with super plastic. So see if you have any predictions of who that might be. And it is such a beautiful design. I absolutely love it. One that I'm still chasing down is Chromosome by OG Slick. And that is just a beautiful, beautiful design. You should definitely check it out. So I'm hoping maybe we'll pull that out of here. Who knows? Let's see what we get. So I'm just going ahead and opening up the bottom of the box again. And we will take out our super plastic foil bag. And let's see what sticker we got. Ooh, we got a shoe dog. Shoe dog is awesome. Absolutely love him, but I didn't have a sticker. So this is awesome because I can add it to my collection. Just in her beautiful form. Like I, I love this design so much, but we have all of her accessories to add. So she has the coolest sunglasses ever. So let's take those out first and look how nicely these come packaged. More of like a cranky design, but instead of a paint can top or anything of that sort, it's actually her little hat. How cute is she? Oh my goodness. She is just perfect. Oh my gosh, I love her. And of course, we can't forget her little beatbox that's going to go right next to her. You are joking me right now. Oh my goodness, guys. This is something that I've always, always wanted to add to my collection. Oh my goodness. Guys, it is the OG. Cool Lagoon set by Super Plastic. Oh my gosh. Okay, first of all, first of all, I'm not going to show you the back because I want you to be surprised, but just look how incredible this box design is. We can see that they're at this haunted carnival making a lot of craziness and trouble around. They, oh my gosh, wait till you see this set. It is so gorgeous. <gasps> And we open the box to reveal the hula goons. Oh my goodness, guys. This is something I've always wanted to add to my collection. I cannot believe this. Super plastic. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much. We are in for such a treat. Let's go ahead and crack them open. I cannot wait any longer. Boogie sticker, which is another sticker I didn't have. And I want this one so bad in real life. So what an amazing sticker. Here is our first guy. I love him. His eye is literally falling out and I love his cape and his tuxedo. So this is our first guy. We then have probably arguably my favorite out of the set because look at his face. That is an incredible design and you'll see there's a little surprise in store for him. And of course, how could we forget? This one is so beautiful too. They really are just amazing. Pumpkin head. I love the orange. It is such a beautiful design. And what's funny too is that it looks like he was carved. It's kind of upraised here. And check out his cape has holes in it. It's incredible what they can do out of vinyl because the detail and attention on these guys is just absolutely beautiful. He's also wearing a hoodie that says slasher, which is very fitting. So now we're going to go ahead and take out all the accessories. So there is his hat. And he also has a magic wand. So we'll add that on as well. So let's see, I think we'll put it in this hand. So now he has his little magician set up and he's gonna go trick-or-treating with his tiny bucket. Oh my goodness, amazing. I love this one so much because he looks kind of regular, but then you take his mask off and he looks a little crazy. What I like to do when I have collectibles with these masks from Super Plastic is actually kind of hang them on their ears because you can still see the mask, but I love to see what's underneath. And he actually comes with a tiny little trick-or-treat bag also that says trick or bath salts on it, which is very, very in line with Super Plastic. There it is. And now he can go trick-or-treating as well. So now he's holding his little trick-or-treat bag and he also has a knife, which of course he needs because we're going pumpkin carving. So there we go. He is all ready for some Halloween fun. So he actually gets another little accessory here for some more Halloween fun. He got some stickers also. So here we have a janky, and I love this one also. These stickers are just incredible. I love Super Plastic just for everything that they are, but the stickers are also beautiful. And they're so much fun to collect. And we also have, oh my gosh, guys, this is a pin that I also don't have. It is the Super Plastic logo pin, which I cannot wait to put with my collection. Oh my gosh, guys, this is one of the Grand Chamaco 
stickers and collectibles that Super Plastic did really early on. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know what your favorite piece that we pulled out of this amazing box from Super Plastic was, and let me know if you collect Super Plastic. Thank you guys again for watching, and see you soon. Bye, guys.